Today's walk brings us to the beautiful place of Dovedale and it's such a tranquil walk along the River Dove. The National Trust looks after this National Nature Reserve which attracts millions of visitors each year. A good place to start the walk is at the car park. There's accessible loos here too. The walk down the limestone valley towards the famous stepping stones is less than half a mile. It's a great stop for a picnic and to spot the wildlife, whatever the season. It's only a short walk, but I highly recommend visiting the area and taking in the beauty of this dale. In my opinion, it's the prettiest of the Derbyshire dales. So these stepping stones mark the end of our accessible walk in Duffdale. It's absolutely beautiful here. But it's time to go back, retrace our steps, and we're going on to Elam, to the National Trust property, for that perfect cup of tea. But before that, I met up with photographer Phil Sproson to share with me his top tips for photographing wildlife. Hi Phil, it's lovely to see you again. And you Debs. What, what, what are you taking today? Um, I've been doing some slow shutter speed stuff on the weir over there. Will you show me how to use my little Canon camera? Yeah, okay. It's just great. So I want to take that duck there. Ah, oh, quick, click, <laughs> got him, it's got him. All right, there you so go. So what, what do you reckon to that then? I think that's fantastic. It's not a bad, not a bad effort. So your top tip for my next walk with my camera? I, I think get lower and shoot more across if, okay. you're, if you're photographing any wildlife. But lower? It, yeah, lower. it's a bit more engaging and you can step into the photo. Aha, uh -huh. okay. Yeah. Yes. Brilliant. Thanks, Phil. Thank you. I think I've earned that cup of tea now. The cafe's not actually wheelchair accessible, but if you order the drinks they'll bring it down to you. It's the perfect way to end the perfect walk. Oh wonderful. The old buttered bun. <laughs>